Immediately after the outbreak of hostilities in 1992, the American Jewish Joint Distribution Committee became one of the critical sources of international help for this besieged city. JDC extended a lifeline of emergency supplies and support to rescue a community cut off from the rest of the world by war. By April of 1992, the situation in Sarajevo had worsened dramatically. Food stocks were down to one week, and shelling was rampant. JDC coordinated an airlift out of the region. Many of those rescued were non-Jews. The Belgrade community provided immediate shelter. Volunteer members of the community helped individuals and families relocate and cope with their new surroundings. Seven months later, in November of 1992, JDC arranged another evacuation, this time by bus. Hundreds came out to say farewell to friends and loved ones who were tearing themselves away from a home shattered by war. At midday, the final evacuation permit had not yet arrived. Bureaucratic confusion and delays threatened to abort this humanitarian evacuation. And I tell to him, if you want to solve this problem, come here. Fear, anxiety, and concern were pervasive. A Red Cross convoy that attempted a rescue evacuation a few days before turned back when a shell hit the leading vehicle. Tourist buses serving as rescue transports had to traverse some 200 treacherous miles of a brutal and unpredictable battleground. After more than 16 hours passed, the ordeal was not over. The rescue convoy had to cross more than 30 checkpoints manned by rival militias to reach safety. 